Thank you, sir. What are you, about 6'1"? <laughs> yeah, about what? Ah, no reason. 6'1". <laughs> television with all the white teeth who keep talking about milk all the time. Well, milk shouldn't upset your stomach. Yeah, well, maybe it's just the kids. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. What's the occasion? I'm rich. I won my bets on the Rose Bowl, the Sugar Bowl, the Cotton Bowl, and I chunked it all on a hockey game, and I won that. Hey, <laughs> all right, all right. How much did you win? 116 bucks. <laughs> can depend on I can absolutely guarantee I'll get him I got a lot of experience with that kind of thing <laughs> what were you doing kneeling on the ground just stood up on his hind legs and bit me. of sangria. Ah, gracias, negro. I... What would you call him? It's <laughs> a very common thing. You know. yeah. I call him negro. It's a very common thing. It's a friendly way of talking to each other. <laughs> She was in a daze. Oh. The reports of her death have been greatly exaggerated. Mark Twain. <laughs> yeah, but it's in public domain now. <laughs> You know, I don't know your name. 
Levine. Stan Levine. I'm Chris. All right. Hey, hey, turn your pockets inside out. I didn't even come in. Inside out, Houdini. You could have my mail. <laughs> Together. Then we wouldn't be here, embarrassed. Well, I uh, I would have done it. We simply couldn't agree on procedures. There was nothing wrong with the sleeping pills. Well, they make me nauseous. <laughs> My husband died. I couldn't stand not being with him. It gets better over time, but it doesn't really go away. I need you to listen to me. I need you to get your act together. So what, you know, big deal? Another kidnapping? Everybody's doing it today, Barney. It's big business. Unfortunately, that's true. Malcontents. It's what it is, Barney. You're probably right. Sure, certainly. <laughs> Knock, knock. Oh, who's there? Ganga Din? Ganga Din who? Open the door, I Ganga Din. <laughs> Man, I wrote a beautiful story about a man and a woman. Who the hell are Harry and Frank? Maybe you better read it and find out. Oh. You write a nice story, you put it in a magazine, you kind of trample things and all that stuff. Well, man, this is disgusting. <laughs> after, what's it been, 12, 13 years? Every time I start to visit this idea of book, I get, I get a little bit. On the, uh, on the charges. All right. Oh, Juan. Listen, I'm, <clears throat> I'm sorry about the door, you know. I, I know you don't like the rough stuff. All right, forget it. You know, I didn't know it was unlocked. <laughs> I was, you know, going up for comedy pilots and stuff like that and getting treated like, you know, but I wasn't getting them. Right. I, was, I, I wasn't playing with, you know, but I kind of had a feeling of like... Oh. to realize the seriousness of this situation. If your daughter decides to file a complaint, you can be charged with kidnapping. My little girl wouldn't do anything like that to us. Well, let's see. Ma'am? I must 
have auditioned for the doorman. I auditioned for everybody just to get an audition for the auditioner yeah. because I, I didn't even have an agent. And my last audition. Was 